there are uh, many areas where there are protests that are under the jurisdiction of the RCMP, and I believe that uh, having that leadership shown at the federal level uh, would certainly send the signal uh, that the Prime Minister is serious about what he's saying. But it's quite clear that he's not. In fact, he's sent the opposite signal. For days, he's been basically telling these illegal protesters uh, that uh, he's taking... He's taking the use of uh, police forces off the table. He's basically been giving them a signal uh, that they can act with impunity. Uh, he's also talked about offering concessions to people who are breaking the law. And as we face developments in the future as it relates to other energy projects, uh, these protesters will continue to be emboldened as they pursue their anti-free market anti-energy development agenda. Nobody is talking about picking up the phone and telling the RCMP to arrest this person or that person, uh, or to uh, enforce the law this way or that way. But it is entirely appropriate, and at this point very necessary, that direction be given to, for example, keep critical infrastructure projects clear and to uphold court injunctions.